The Lost Voyage of Eudoxus of Cyzicus How the Misfortunes of a Greek Geographer and Navigator Open up trade routes from Greece to India and introduced modern geometry. Eudoxus of Cyzicus was an incredible explorer and sea navigator from ancient Greece, who is remembered in the historical records as one of the earliest sailors to successfully make the journey between Arabian and Indian ports. Under contract from Egypt's Hellenistic Ptolemaic dynasty leader, Ptolemy VIII, Eudoxus explored the Arabian Sea with great skill and precision. He also made a daring attempt to circumnavigate Africa during the 2nd century BC, an incredibly brave endeavor that became known throughout history. Eudoxus was a true pioneer of sailing and navigation, known for being able to travel long distances without ever losing sight of land or getting lost. He managed to understand currents and wind patterns better than any other sailor of his time, allowing him to make journeys much faster than those before him. His incredible skills allowed him to explore waters that had never been ventured before, discovering new lands and trading routes along the way. The bravery he exhibited in attempting to circumnavigate Africa is particularly noteworthy, as it took immense courage and determination for a man of his era to attempt such a feat. The legendary Greek sailor Eudoxus of Cyzicus was renowned for his insight and great ambition, setting out on the uncharted oceans of antiquity in search of adventure and exploration. According to ancient records by Posidonius and other sources, it was Eudoxus who first heard of this new way of sailing using the monsoon winds from an Indian sailor who had been shipwrecked and brought to the court of Ptolemy VIII in Alexandria. With this newfound knowledge, Eudoxus set off on his first journey to India in 118 BC defying all odds as he navigated through powerful storms and treacherous seas. The voyage took nearly a year to complete, but when Eudoxus returned home he had brought with him a veritable treasure trove of precious gems and fragrant spices from faraway lands. This cargo included rare spices such as nutmeg, cardamom, mace, and cinnamon as well as exotic stones such as rubies, sapphires, and emeralds. These aromatics and gemstones went on to form an important part of the trade in ancient Greece, providing much-needed wealth to many parts of the country. In 116 BC he embarked on a second voyage, determined to prove that such a feat could be achieved without the aid of his initial companion. Day after day he pushed further into unknown waters, relying solely on his budding expertise with the seasonal wind patterns, a method that he would have continued to use for years to come if not for a grave accident along his voyage. Fortunately, with the help of some local fishermen in India, Eudoxus made it out alive and eventually returned home, having accomplished an incredible feat that established him as one of history's greatest sailors. On his return voyage home from his second journey to India, Eudoxus encountered a particularly eventful ordeal. After being pushed by strong winds to the shoreline of East Africa, he stumbled upon a strange and peculiarly designed shipwreck. Desperate to figure out what nation could have created such a vessel, Eudoxus concluded that it must have been crafted by the people inhabiting Gades, the modern-day Cadiz in Spain. This discovery made him strongly believe that circumnavigating Africa was more than possible, it was achievable. Thus, determined and motivated, he organized an expedition of his own and set off for this ambitious mission. Eudoxus of Cyzicus was a daring individual who, despite an arduous reorganization, refused to surrender his ambition. He ventured forth on his quest, never to be heard from again. The silence that followed this brave man spoke volumes about the potential dangers of his voyage. Many believe that the unfortunate truth is that he lost his life somewhere in the depths of his grand adventure. Of course, this accusation cannot be proven and stands as nothing more than speculation, yet it serves as a grave reminder that even those with the valor of Eudoxus can succumb to the mysteries of nature's fury. An indomitable spirit such as Eudoxus should never be forgotten, for he will forever serve as an example of how human courage can reach far beyond what we can comprehend. In addition to his skill as a mariner, Eudoxus wrote works on astronomy that are still referenced today. 
His writings have been praised for their accuracy in mapping out constellations in great detail and predicting eclipses accurately centuries before modern technology could do so. He also wrote about geometry which has greatly influenced generations after him. You could even say that Eudoxus was one of the first people who truly understood mathematics. This amazing ancient Greek explorer's legacy lives on today through his impressive accomplishments both at sea and in writing. He has become an inspiration for future generations of sailors who strive to make their discoveries as Eudoxus did centuries ago. Through his work we can be sure that Eudoxus will never be forgotten, he was truly one of history's most remarkable adventurers.